guys, if you want to learn how to catch these yourself, check out our Swordfish 101 playlist where we walk you through everything that you need to do to go out and catch one of these guys. We are out here on the sword grounds today. It is a beautiful July day. We got winds out of the southeast, five to 10 knots. Seas are less than a foot. I mean, we couldn't ask for anything better. Well, we could. We would love to go back home plus one. Would love to go back home plus two on uh, Bradbill Swordfish today. We got a great special for them. No admission into our ice box. We're gonna go ahead and set these lines and see if we can't get tied on a swordfish today. My son's not here with us today. He's at his mom's house this weekend. But he loves to give this thing a kiss for good luck. So we're gonna do it in his name. Give this thing a nice little kiss. And he always sends it down and tells it to go ahead and get him a swordfish. So in his memory, we're gonna do that today and see if we can't get tight on one. All right, guys, we are fighting a fish that we've been fighting for exactly one hour now. Really was stubborn in the beginning. Now it seems to be coming up. She pulls down every now and then, but uh, super late. It's six o'clock. And we've been at this thing all day is the only bite we had. We have one bite and we hooked her and uh, hopefully she's a keeper for dinner. Seiscento pie. And a little feisty now. 400 feet to go. And we have a massive storm coming. Not good. Let's see if we can't get her up before we get, get that storm. Hopefully she cooperates when we get her boat side. I don't know if you can see it in the camera, but there is a nasty thunderstorm coming. Primo. Vamos a darle un break un momentico, baja la antena esa. Oh. 
It is a really bad lightning storm. I'm gonna get a radar here and see how far away that is. Looks like it's just under six miles from us. But we can see the lightning strikes and hear the thunder. It's definitely something we don't want to play around with is lightning. Lo siento, gente. Get the promo, get the promo. Primo, desengancha el plomo. Ahí hay un pescado. Siempre desengancha el plomo. No jodan, si no la medida hay que cogerlo por el pico. Mira la está. Espérate, que yo no creo que sea la medida. Espérate, hay que cogerlo por el pico. Saca el tape de medir. Oh, I think that might be a short. We're gonna check real quick. 49 inches. So by two inches. Oh. Good little 75, 80 pounder. But a great way to end a very long day. Let me not drop this guy in the water. And let's get him on ice. And head home and fire up the barbecue. Guys, if you want to learn how to catch these yourself, check out our Swordfish 101 playlist where we walk you through everything that you need to do to go out and catch one of these guys. We'll link it at the end of this video so you guys can check it out. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions. We'll be glad to help you out on your journey.